tofu. Pro I think. tip at the very beginning of this video, now we're in it because I said that. Sparkling water is the greatest palate cleanser of all time. It is. Nice. It is. It it's is. just the best. Welcome back. We're the Burma Junkies. Yup. This is another blind barrel adventure. This is a video in which series in which I win a five hundred dollar bottle of whiskey <coughs> by beating Sean in blinds four times a year. Sorry. You guys miss poor guesses. This intro. is basically a four whiskey poor guess. There's an intro in there somewhere. Right here. So yeah, Ish. Blind Barrels is a company that if you guys don't know that you can sign up for. We're doing the March box right now. What you do is you go sign up. There's a link, uh, promo code, use that. You get some money back. Don't worry about it. Um, do it. What you get is four samples every quarter. So this is the, the first one of this year. It was March, you guys would already have it. Or you can save it and drink along with us. We're gonna be doing do four that. guesses with it. It's so much fun. Um, Listen, you yeah. get these the best tasting thinger i've ever seen the made. table the tasting table it's called call a table it. of tasting some yep. would say you go like oh i get a veg note which one narrow it down narrow it down this is literally like for real how you get better at tasting you should notes, be doing for real things. yeah we um learned the hard way which is probably why we're mediocre at it no. but the, um this is really cool these come very blind to you they come yeah. with a little note like you can read this if you want. If you don't want to, this never spoils it, but it'll give you some, like this one's cool. It gives you a couple tips. But then when you're done drinking them and you see which one you like, you scan this QR code and it will tell you everything, everything. about each sample. Yeah. This is the best way, in my personal opinion, to find craft, craft whiskeys distillery. across the country. Yeah. That you're not, you don't have to be local to them. You just, this is a great way to try. Because a lot of whiskeys. times, yeah, you have to be local or else you'll never know about some of these smaller places. 100%. Distribution footprint's very small. Yeah. So it just helps you find other places. So check out Blind Barrels. They Dark. are freaking awesome. And the packaging on these boxes yeah, is great. Yeah, great. It's very svelte. Some would say. Very soft box. Sample number three is dark. Okay. I'm gonna read you the tips. Sean and I are gonna play a game. We're doing this four it's times throughout the year. It's poor guesses rules, but whoever wins after all four videos literally wins a five hundred dollar bottle from the other person. So these are the tips, and I'm gonna read them to you so we have the same tips. Okay. Because I already read this. Oh. Some killer tidbits about this lineup. One sample is hazmat. One comes from a distillery that only has 80, well, dude, obtainium can be hazmat and clear. That's true. Um, one comes from a distillery that only has 80 barrels in existence. Okay. One is a barrel pick that was the also the favorite of the distiller's wife. Okay. One okay. sister barrel, one best and show at New York Spirits Competition. Okay. So those are the tips that we have. We're going to guess type, proof, finish, and age on these four. Yes. One point if you get it right. That's just, it's just as simple as it gets. I don't think we ran a timer last time. I think we just kind of went through it. Yeah, which is probably not the right way to do it, but here you know, we are. Here we are. Also, look at how cool these little sample bottles are. There's, and this is a pretty healthy amount of whiskey for like a sample. Yeah, um, it's a solid two ounces for sure. I'll tell you, if you dump it all into a Glen, it's that much. So, well, if you're wondering, it says the proof on the back of the bottle. Which one did you see? A. No, oh, you lost a point already. Didn't didn't know it said that on there. Is and it in just, fine print? Yeah. Oh it's, no. It's uh, right down there in like I'm little not looking. letters. I refuse to look. Tiny dude. little letters. No. I was just was wondering what was I'm on the back still, of the bottle. That's fair. I still get to guess. That's fine. Because I'm not a cheater. You're just pouring it all, huh? Uh, why am I doing that? I don't know. Me neither. I'm so glad you said that because I don't need to. You know what? Let's see if we can't get eight, whisk, eight ounces of whiskey in your gullet before we go shoot another video. After I started looking at it, my oh, brain it was like, hey, that's a percentage, dummy. That's probably the ABV. Hey, that can't mean a lot of other things. This one yeah. smells good. It does. It smells very fruit cocktail. Very fruity. Mm, I, I would guess that proof. Man, that tastes like a honey barrel. That actually tastes like um, a proof. That is so fruity. Fruit to that tastes like fruit cocktail, the, the, the syrup in the jar, and in the honey. can. So much honey I get in that. I like that a that's lot. That's really good. If that's not a honey barrel finish, that's the most honey. Does it I've have ever... the viscosity is the question. It has the flavor. It does. Does it have the viscosity? Honestly, that doesn't taste soup. That's not youthy. And maybe it's because of a finish. I forgot we um, we, we guess if it's finished or not. So I'm gonna stop talking. It's It tastes like fruit. <laughs> Yeah. Like actual fruit. Like it it doesn't taste like it has a hint of fruit. Man. It tastes like all the fruit. So rich. I get the green grape in the fruit cocktail can. Oh really? Yeah, that's the exact flavor. 
It's got some of that like dry, woody, almost cedar box notes on At it. At the for end, me. yeah. It's um, short, sharp up front in a good way because it's like a really punchy, yeah, yeah. bright honeyed fruit flavor. I like that one a lot. What I don't would know you what... say the proof is if you knew it? You want to write proof? No. <laughs> I was just trying to ask the local expert, you know? You know what? I get to hedge, actually, because you can't out-hedge me. You're correct this on is, that one. You know I what? Literally... 95 on the dot. Love Perfect. that. <laughs> You're wrong. <laughs> <laughs> 98. I was just kidding, dude. Um, That's like a 105-er. Dang it. Okay. Oh, I okay. I'm I read it pretty be. close. If you're wondering, it's 51.3. It's 102. I just went 100 like in... I wrote up, down 102. I think I get it. B. B. This one's nice, like, nice and dark, too. Oh. Ooh, right off the bat, that smells pear? like a Maker's. Oh. Oh, it does. It, you're so right. Yeah. It reminds me of Horse Soldier. Oh, yeah. It's, it's like, it's really rosy. Floral. Like, it's got that rose water. It's hyper floral. <sighs> if you ever walked into a flower shop, mm. this is what it smells like. It's got a cornbread note on it. Mm -hmm. Oh my goodness. On the palate. Yeah. That's not what I was expecting at all on the, the palate, if I'm going to be completely honest. I was expecting way more of the... It's in this, the finish. What? I get like a rose stem in the finish. Yeah, I was expecting something a lot more uh, rosy and floral yeah. based off the nose. I get Way literally... more like uh, a maker's cask. Here's the thing. On the nose, it's not corn forward. No. On the I, palate, it's if corn If you go forward. back and if I'm re-smelling it right now, yeah. I get a little bit of that uh, cornbread note in there. I, I feel like it's still overwhelmed by the rosiness. I get like brownie batter too in it on the nose. <sighs> That's weird. It's wild. How'd you sneak in here? I'm about to karate kid this fucking fly, dude. Two things are kind of throwing me on this one here. Wait for it. And I already wrote proof. In Got him. No, you didn't. I, I let him free. I see him flying away. Yeah, because I let him go, dude. C. Yes. That is black, dude. It's so great, dude. It's, I mean, it's got a little red. It's not oh, quite that red tint. That smells phenomenal. All of these are craft. This smells like legacy. Mm -hmm. Like for real. Does it taste as good as it smell? That is earthy. That is a damp forest floor. That's wild. Oh, but on the back, it's got it's that really, rich oak. It's gnarly old oak is what yeah. it is. That's where I get that earthiness Up from. Up it's mossy. It, it is. And then on the back, it's sweet caramel oak. Like That's you, very weird. Have you ever gone past if someone's like spraying down mulch? And you just yeah. get that like heavy, yes. earthy smell? Yeah. That's how this tastes. That's weird. I wonder if it's a small barrel thing. It, that would explain the color. Yeah. Or double oaked maybe, but Could it doesn't be. taste double oaked though. Mm -mm. That's about as dark as whiskey gets. I mean, it doesn't get a lot darker than that. It smells phenomenal. The nose is literally a brown foreman portfolio nose. Yeah. Uh, I'm going to be honest. I want to guess the age is high on this, but I feel like that's a trap. Did a lot of hedging yeah, on this one. That's fair. Let's see. I wrote first. What do you got, Cheater? That's good. So far, that's my favorite one. That one's wild. I can tell you that. It lasts forever. I like the I like the change throughout it. I like up front that it's earthy and then it goes into this oak. I yep. like that a lot. It's not. It's like not a simple thing. It's close. We got some different answers <sighs> Thank there. Thank God. Okay, we'll move on to D. Yeah. Okay. Last one. Oh, I'm okay. I think I know. I wish like the if, theme now. If we're doing a type, I yeah. feel like I know what this is. Man, this has got like caramel Thank in it. Thank God for we me. guessed type. Yeah, a lot of caramel. Almost like a simple caramel. Like a just straightforward, hey man, you like caramel? You're like, yep. You're like, that's what it smells like. Yeah. <laughs> that's what it smells like. <laughs> that wring every bit of moisture out. I'm completely done. I, I think I know what that is. Not from like a standpoint of, I like, guess, the bottle. Like off the nose. I was like, okay, that, this tracks for me. Nope, nope, nope. Nope. MGP light whiskey? Nope, nope, nope. Man, age is gonna throw me on this. I, I don't, the back does not say all the stuff, by the because way. So. To get to hazmat, know. even going, I mean, unless it's light. Yeah. Man. Um. Okay, I wrote everything. This is a, uh, man. Um, like an Obtanium? So that was just my guess off the nose. Obtanium? Mm -hmm. It smells like MGP light whiskey. Yeah. Tastes that, like My it. guess off the nose was that it's just light whiskey, yeah. for sure. Hey, let's figure this the F out. This didn't work for my camera last time, so. Friggin' Samsung. Okay. Ready? Yes, so. Sample I. 
No. I'm going to click it. Why wouldn't we say our answers first? Oh, okay. Um, I said 102 proof. <laughs> oh, okay. Which is 102 proof. I said 95. Um, I said bourbon. Me I just too. realized I had type first and then went to proof. It, I, I wondered said, why. I said finish, yes. I said finish, yes. Um, I said age four. I said five. It is Devil's Creek Distillery. That says straight, does it not? Straight bourbon, bourbon whiskey. That means it's not going to be finished. So Devil's this is from Creek? Devil's Creek Distillery, Mammoth Lake, California. This only this is the 80 one. 80 barrels. Oh. Age statement four, baby. Okay, I was one year off. Look, I'm, <laughs> I didn't do bad. Um, Not finished. And, oh, you don't get proof. Thank God, I forgot. I'm like, you nailed but it is proof bourbon, on the so head. That. I'm like sitting here like so, so upset get bourbon. that you nailed proof. And I got the age. But it's because you read it. Yeah. And you still wrote it like a little cheater. Yeah. Sam that B. Is, hold on. That's straight bourbon whiskey that yeah. tastes like that. We thought it was finished. And I just said that craft bourbon doesn't get off the wall. That's off the wall. Yeah. It's fruity as hell. Okay, um, anyways. Yeah, they had some wild uh, notes in there. Oh, did they? And stuff like that. That tracks. That makes sense. Okay, really quick. You got two on that? Yep. And I got one. Yes. Okay. Uh, same will be. I said bourbon. Same. I said 108 proof. I said 110. Please be like I 112. I said finish no. I said no. I said age three. I said three. Yeah, we can just throw this one away. Oh, it's Fred Ranch. Ranch. Dude, okay. Oh, no points on proof. It's 120. I was closer. Do I get a point? Nope. 122.2 proof. Okay. Were you 20 off? No. Damn it. That'd be 102. So I was not. Uh, it is four years, seven months. We both but said we, three. It doesn't yeah, it doesn't really matter. Um, it is not finished. Okay, this is a four grain, isn't it? Six dent yeah. corn, winter wheat, winter rye, and two row barley. That's, That's what makes it we, funky. Yeah. It's a four grain. Okay, that makes more sense. Okay, sample C. I said bourbon. Same. 116 proof. I said 115. It's Come probably on, 118. 118. Um, finish. I said yes. I said no. It's really dark. It I don't know if it's like a double. Anyways, I said five years. I said seven. I think you're right on the small barrel. Oh, Don't I've seen those. Them? I've seen uh, some of them just Star. one of these. Um, so that's from Statesville, North Carolina. It's from Southern Distilling Company. It is a 116 proof. I'll take that. Wait, wait, wait. It's 116. Are I you fucking it. serious? I, I was it. one off and didn't get a point. I can't tell you emotionally statement how that push. affects me. I can't tell you. How is it a push? Six years. What'd I said you five put? and you said seven. Oh, I Price is right. Game, dude, I'm never playing Cl this game Close without going over. I hate this game so much. I have been it literally, I was one year off. I was one proof off and I'm one year off. I've got no points across those three being one off. I think you're, I don't think it is finished though. So I think you get that point. That's yeah. just Jesus giving me a break, you know? Man. That's I, some bullshit. This has got to be small barrel. Um, if it is that color in six years. This is this stuff's wild. This is the sister barrel to the one that won um, in the New York Spirits competition. I just want everybody to know that this quarter's box, I'm just getting shafted. It's fantastic though. Good box. Yeah, honestly, it really Sable was. D. I said light. Yeah. After you said wheat. Light. Yeah, sure. I hate you so much. 144 proof. What'd you this say? This is why we quit playing for you. What'd you say? 144 proof. 143. <laughs> I hate you. And I know what the proof is. So finish no. I said no. I said age five. Did you say age? That doesn't matter, does it? I think I said 10. Ah, this is obtainium. I said 10. I guess that on the nose. 151 no. proof? Yeah. I guess on the nose it was that. And what pisses me off is what I'm not gonna get shit rules? for it. I don't it. I don't think I get proof. I'm uh, no, neither was seven proof. off. Yeah. Wait, it was Dang, five. That's man. hot. Age statement twenty six? Oh, it's Canadian whiskey. It's 100% it, corn. It's Canadian whiskey. Yeah, we're not getting that age statement, buddy. Um, but, so is that light whiskey? Like, what do I get? What's it called? All right, you guys get to decide. I don't... This, do I get a point for light or not? It's a wash either way. No, you said American. Amer... Oh, shh. So you wouldn't So get I it. smelled it, guessed it. Don't get a point <laughs> because it's actually Canadian light whiskey, not American whiskey. But it is light whiskey. So that takes me up to 13. I don't know what I have, dude. It doesn't matter anymore. How many do you get today? I don't know. I need to know how many you got so I can tell the people. How many Five. you get? Five. So you're up to nine. I was one number off three times. Let that be known. I just want that to be, that's I was to me. dead on once. After you looked at the back one? Nope, not that one. <laughs> sure, dude, whatever you have. 
And I would have probably wrote 100 I can't believe I guessed for... 115. You guessed 116. It's 116. I guess seven. It's six. You guessed five. I guess America. I think it's obtainium. Off the nose. Swear to God. Literally. You're like, is this a weed? I'm like, definitely not. Idiot. Guess it. No points. And then I said, it feels like oh, whiskey. Oh my gosh. That's annoying. You know? Damn it. Gene. How Thanks, dare Gene. you? That's uh, They said that was the Wait. I, do I get a... Were we doing closer to on age? Within reason. I was way closer. Within reason. I guess 10. You guys leave a comment down below and say if I should get the 16 point or not. 16 years? Then I get the point for light whiskey because it's light whiskey. No, it's not. All Canadian's not light. All has not light. What do you think that was distilled or entry proof at? I don't know. Canada doesn't have rules. Yeah, but it's still 151 right now. I bet it went in hot. Might have. Might have? May have. Okay. Does Coy Hill go in hot? Okay, I did say closest too, but also within Leave a comment. reason, my guy. Thank you, Blind Barrels, for working with the channel. You were 16 years off. But you I was have doubled closer. your guess. I was and so much still closer. Not been that close. What did you guess? Six? Five. Oh my gosh, you're 21 years. You were a legal drinking age off. I've, I should have guessed seven, I think, honestly, because I was thinking it's MGP light whiskey. It, how crazy is it that that smells the same as MGP light whiskey? It's, well, it's 100% corn. I know MGP's light whiskey isn't 100% corn. 99.1? <laughs> yeah. Dude, that's weird. Different yeast. You guys want to play along? We'll be doing this a couple more times. Two more times. So far, somehow, magically. Not giving you that age. Sean's winning.